99th came eyeball to eyeball in air-to-air -air combat with the German Luftwaffe. Bombers would be here, we'd be above the bombers to provide sort of a net against the German planes coming down. We said we'd better get a real name and identification so that the bombers and the Germans would know when we were on a mission. And it was decided jointly that we would paint the tails red and we became known as the Red Tails. Hi there. How you doing, sir? Good. I'm here with uh, uh, a handsome young man, Dr. Roscoe Brown. Uh, I used uh, to be better looking. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're at the production day for this great movie, Red Tails, that honors the, the story of the Tuskegee Airmen. Well, it tries to, because, I mean, you can't tell the story of the Tuskegee Airmen in two, two hours, I'm but sure. But they did a pretty good job. They, they yeah. caught the uh, ambition. They caught the challenge. They caught uh, some of the racism. And they certainly showed the camaraderie and the bonding that we had as pilots and even the competition we had among each other. And uh, because of the digital effects of combat, it brings the audience right there. They feel that they are right with the pilots. Almost every audience, when you see a plane get shot down, cheers because they have identified. And the other thing is, is they have to provide a balance between the combat activity and the racism and the stereotyping that we experience. And I think all in all, they did a good job of that. It's not preachy. It does talk about what happened. And right. Practically everything in there happened in some way, not exactly the way it was in the movie. But right. it does show that they didn't think we could do it. It does show that we did experience some prejudice from some of the white pilots. It does show that they came around. It does show that we were successful in the air and shooting down planes and blowing up locomotives and blowing up destroyers. So that, that's the story right. that comes through Red Tails. Right. There's been a lot of movies about military and war, but they, they don't often see people that look like us that's in there. And how, how important do you think it was not only to tell the, the story that, that, that's your story, but to tell a story and, and for young African Americans to be able to see us fighting and fighting for our country and, and everything else like that? How important was that part of the story? Oh, well, that, that's really reflective of the Double V campaign that the black press started during the war victory over the enemy overseas and victory over racism at home. Mm. Unfortunately, most of the World War II movies have not shown African Americans in any significant role. Some of the movies like Platoon did show that. But this way is a collective group of people, an uh, outstanding group of people right. in the highest branch of the military, the Air Force, uh, showing that we could overcome the stereotypes that said we didn't have the intelligence or the coordination or the leadership ability to be pilots. Mm -hmm. And it turns out we did that and more right. because of our leader, Ben Davis, Colonel Benjamin Davis, who taught us the discipline of staying with the bombers so that we protect them. That was our job. And even though some other pilots may have shot down more planes, we protected the bombers. We got people home. That was right. our job, and it was well recognized. And then, of course, on the longest mission of the 15th Air Force, 
on March 24, 1945, 1,600 miles round trip to Berlin. We shot down the first jets, wow. and I was the first to shoot down the jet over Berlin. So that was something that's portrayed in the movie. It's portrayed beautifully. Uh, the cast of characters are composite. No, no one person is Roscoe Brown or Lee Archer or Wendell Pruitt, but it's right. a composite of where we were. Right. Namely, we were confident, we were arrogant, we were efficient, and we were competitive. Wow. Well, I think this movie is not only inspiring, I mean, in, entertaining, but it's inspiring. So I think well, you Well, we hope it's inspiring time. to all young people. To all young people. But particularly African Americans. All right. Thank you, Dr. Brown. Thank you. Okay, Javon. Pleasure meeting you. Take care. You.